Welcome back to the next video in your Simply Aroma ongoing training program. Last week I shared with you exactly how to use your guest care card and your wish list during your parties. Hopefully you've completed the worksheet with the language for how you'll introduce these two very important tools during your party. And now you're ready to move on to the next step in your training. This week we're going to be talking about your sponsoring commercial. Remember, you created your booking commercial during the new consultant training portion of this training. And the opportunity commercial is the second really important commercial that you're going to want to create. Up until now, you've just been sharing your excitement about your new business during your parties, which is great and it's a really general way to do that. And just extending an invitation for anybody who's interested to learn more. Now it's time to learn how to get a little more intentional about sharing your opportunity during your parties in a really clear way. Let's start by talking about the obvious fear that you may have around talking about your opportunity, that you'll come across as pushy. I want to address this for a second and just get it out of the way up front. If you're sharing with the intention of getting someone to do something, you're always going to feel like you're being pushy, because that is kind of pushy. There's just no way around that. You have to make a shift away from trying to leverage them to sign up and towards simply sharing your passion for what you do. You have to move away from trying to get them to sign up. I actually gave them permission to not be interested. I told them it was perfectly fine with me if they weren't interested because it was. I really didn't want someone who wasn't interested in my opportunity tuning me out because they thought I was going to try to talk them into doing something that they didn't want to do. Think about how much you hate that. Nobody likes to be pushed or leveraged. It really makes everyone uncomfortable. But if you just say up front, it's okay if you're not interested, but please listen to my commercial from the perspective of who you know who could really use this. You open them up to listening to you without judgment or worry that you're going to ambush them with a sign-up sheet or an opportunity brochure at the end of the commercial. And once they really do listen to you without any worry, they just might decide that this is something that they want to explore. And at the very least, they might think of someone in their life for whom this really could be perfect. And because you're so non-pressure and they like you, they're going to share that person's information. It's really amazing how such a simple shift can make such a huge difference, but it does. Now I'm going to go through my opportunity commercial and how to use a really great visual, which I call the Y bag, in just a second. But before I do, I want to reiterate that you have to share from your heart why you love your job and your company, and you have to let everybody know that you're not there to talk anybody into doing anything. You just want to tell them why you're passionate about what you do. I want to share the language for my Opportunity Commercial first. This is what I actually said at the beginning of my Opportunity Commercial. I want you to hear how I made sure that I spoke from my heart about sharing my opportunity. This is how that sounded. Ladies, I want to take a minute and share with you why I love my job. I love this part of my party because I'm passionate about letting other women know how this company has completely changed my life. Now, I don't know how many of you cried all the way to work after dropping your child off at daycare like I used to this morning. I don't know if you laid awake last night worrying about how you were going to pay your bills. I have no way of knowing how many of you have kids heading off for college with no way to pay for that, or maybe you're facing retirement and wondering what you're going to do with the rest of your life. What I do know is that all of those scenarios are common for the women on my team. And I've seen this opportunity literally change lives. I know none of you came here tonight looking for a job, and that's fine. What I want to invite you to do is listen from the perspective of who you know who could use my opportunity. I know this business was literally an answered prayer for me. And if you do know someone for whom this really would also be an answered prayer, you could become an angel in that person's life by sharing. So just listen from that perspective. Now how are you feeling about me as a consultant if you're a guest and you've just heard that introduction? 
Well, hopefully you feel like I'm sincere. You want to give me a hug? <laughs> that what I'm up to is sharing and that my goal is not to recruit you. I even said, this might not be for you. That's okay. That puts your guests at ease and they're going to be much more likely to listen to the rest of your opportunity commercial. I often got referrals at the end of a lot of my parties because of this language. So once you've shared from the heart, you're ready to step into showing them what you love about your job. Now one of the easiest ways to do this is to use props or other visual aids to signify each item that you're talking about. I'd like you to choose four or five reasons why you love your job and then design a fun, compelling way to show your audience that reason. I actually used a bag, I called it a Y bag, with props in it. Now I'm going to go through the language and what I actually put in the bag in just a second. The first thing that you want to say though, before you pull this bag out, is something, something like, I use this bag of reminders because there's so much I love about my job that I'm afraid I'm going to forget something. If you just pull out the bag and start pulling things out of it, pulling props out of it, no one's really going to understand what you're doing. So using a fun or attractive bag, pull each prop out as you talk about it, or alternatively, you can also pass the bag around and have your guests pull out the prop and tell you what they think it represents, and that's also kind of fun. Then share with them. Here's how this part of my commercial sounded. The first thing in my bag is a picture of my kids. I'm able to be home with them and they're not in daycare, which is very important to me. What's next? Oh, I love this part. You know, I always acted a little bit surprised as if I had kind of forgotten how cool this part was. So you can kind of do that if you want. This is a little toy airplane and this represents all of the trips conventions and free travel that I have been able to go on with my company. I love to travel and it's really fun when someone else is paying the bills. This next item is my CPA's business card. I'll tell you, I had no idea what owning my own business would do for our taxes. My husband was thrilled and frankly a little surprised the first year that we filed our taxes after I got started with my business. Finally, I have $100 in cash and yes, I used real $20 bills. Hold out your hand, Sue. Count with me, ladies. 20, 40, 60, 80, $100. That's how much I make each night I do a party. And I have to tell you, I almost feel guilty because I have as much fun as you do. So if you know of anybody who could use a little more fun or money in their lives, I would love to visit with them. Just corner me after the party and I'll chat with you about connecting with them. And if you're interested in learning more, make sure that you track me down because I have a gift for you to take home with you tonight. This is just an example and you might use a scrapbook, you might find a way to weave in your own products to make this fun for you. Any props will work. The key is to feel comfortable with whatever it is that you choose and to keep it visual. Now let's look at your action steps for this training. Download and complete the Creating an Opportunity commercial worksheet from the Simply Aroma website. That's all the training for this week. It's imperative that you make the time to download the worksheet creating your opportunity commercial and that you take the time to complete it this week. Building your team is a crucial component to your success as a Simply Aroma consultant and having this commercial ready is really a key to sponsoring and building from your parties. You're going to be using it during your host coaching appointments as well and we'll be talking about that in a later video. So please make sure that you've completed this before next week's training. I'll see you next time.